Hi there, Susan here. I'm happy to be back in Bali in my red room, as you can see, all my red, pinks, and purples, and to be back uh, doing some videos. And today I want to talk about trusting ourselves and just even very simple issues about trusting ourselves. It's always often a good time place to start is with very simple <laughs> issues. And I'm just going to give you a very simple uh, example. When I was in Chiang Mai, I didn't have a return ticket to Bali. And I just didn't have one. And I didn't know when I was coming back. So I had a sense originally when I went of being there about a month. But a month came and went, you know, and there I was still in Chiang Mai. And I had this sense that when the right time came to come back to Bali, I would know what that was. And in fact, that's exactly what happened. When the right time came, I knew it was time. I bought a ticket. Here I am. So that's an example, though, of trusting myself, trusting myself that I knew what was going to be best for me. And so how do we do this, you know, without judging ourselves? Because what often happens is we start judging ourselves. Oh, I should know what I'm doing. How come I'm staying longer? I should be buying a ticket. Uh, what's the matter, et cetera, et cetera. You know, we often start judging ourselves. So how can we just stay with, I know the answer. You know, I know it will come to me when the time is right. Of course, one thing is to be still to not be running around, distracting ourselves, or ju especially or judging ourselves all the time. But just to say, okay, I know. I know for myself what is best. We just keep reinforcing that for ourselves so that we're not judging ourselves all the time. And then just allowing, just allowing ourselves to take our own process, whatever our own process is, and then supporting ourselves when we make a decision, when, when we're clear about what it is and how we've trusted ourselves, then supporting ourselves. Okay, I did this. I can do it again. This is an example of trusting myself. So this is an example of what all of us can do and what you can do as well. And of course, it's easier to take a simple example, like the air flight, uh, than uh, the, some of the more complicated uh, issues that come up for all of us. But they're all very similar. You know, they're all basically the same, which is, can we pay attention to ourselves? Can we give ourselves space? Give ourselves this time and space to come to a decision about whatever it is we're talking about and know at some level that we will come to the decision that's best for us. Okay, I'd be happy to help you with this. Talk more about it. Drop me a line. My uh, email is at the bottom here. And my website is susanspellman.com. Easy. <laughs> okay. Bye-bye.